When David and I were asked to be a part of the conference, we both expressed concern to one another that we wanted to make sure that this didn't become some kind of an advertisement for True Hope. I know that um, we're out there and, and we're doing what we can to help the people that struggle with various mood disorders and we've been through a lot. But I think it's important to realize that this is about micronutrient supplementation. Come what may, wherever that comes from. And there are so many wonderful things out there and no company possesses it. Possesses it. It's, that's not the purpose behind this at all. I want you to know that our purpose as a company is to get this researched so that it can be put into the hands of the professionals that need to do this. And we've got a growing number of professionals that are doing this and we're working with more and more all the time and that's where we want to go. All of the research that's taken place here has been absolutely independent. We've never paid five cents for it. It's because of good people who had a desire to find out if this was really a scam or if it was really true, did it really, really work? So it's a, it's a collaborative venture. And the bottom line is bringing to people a situation where they can find normality in their life. But when you give the body everything it needs, what you're hoping that it will do, right, is, is be its own regulator. That's the very best scenario. If you can take away the manipulators of the drugs, I believe anyway, and give the body an opportunity to regulate itself, that's where you're going to get the very best quality of life in the end. When David and I first started this 13 years ago, we were thrown into it. It wasn't about building a company at all. It was to support our families, to make sure that they had product that they needed to maintain their mental wellness. And it's morphed, it's taken on a totally different picture. Not of our own desire in that sense. We're in this for the long term and we'll continue to do this. I believe in the past, in the paradigm, that people did the best that they, they could with whatever tools they had. That's okay. We build better buildings today. We build better airplanes, better jets, better transportation systems than we ever did before. Our information systems have come ahead in a marvelous way. And now it's time to look at other areas. And I think that health is one of them. As you look at any paradigm shift, um, you will always have major resistance. Shifts happen, yes, but not on their own. They're created and they're created by good people. We're into an exciting era. This micronutrients for mental health and health in general is just an exciting place to be. I'm excited to be here with you. I'm excited to have you uh, contribute to the expanding area of knowledge as, you know, as we look at this and what it can do. There's a lot of science behind this. It really does explain better than anything else that we know why these disorders in mental illness exist. It's really the only explanation that there is. It makes any sense. So this group is going to carry it forward. So let's go.